Hi, welcome back to Obsess Interact. This Thursday, I'm going to do five looks with the same palette. The palette I'm using is the Lorac Unzipped Gold. Um, I mentioned this in my monthly favorites. It's an incredible palette. It's got 10 colors. And with these 10 colors, you can make so many looks. And I'm to starting today with five, and I will be continuing on and eventually make 25 looks all with this palette. So today, the five looks I'm gonna make are gonna end with this look I'm wearing right now. This is sort of my go-to look with this palette. It's big, it's dramatic, it's bright. If you wanna see how I do it, stay tuned. It's the last look in this video, um, and I hope you enjoy. The Lorac Unzipped Gold Palette includes 10 colors. It cost $42 at Ulta or Kohl's. It also includes a small sized uh, primer, eyeshadow primer, that I've used on all the looks. There are four matte and six shimmer shades, and I'll be using all of them over the course of the 25 looks. The four brushes I use in this on these looks are a tapered large shadow brush for almost for all over coverage, a pointed crease brush, a round densely packed brush that I use for brow highlight and inner corner highlight, a large crease blending brush that I use for all of my big blending strokes. Look one is a sort of more muted look using only three shadows. We start with the matte shade Undress, covering the whole eye all the way up to the brow bone. I'm going to use Unlocked along the lid. Using my crease brush, I go in with Unwind. Highlight again with Unlocked on the inner corner and the brow to bring in some brightness. Blend to get rid of any harsh lines, and we're all done. So there's look one. Good everyday kind of look, a little bit of shimmer, a little bit of sparkle, but mostly people will see brown. Um, I think for me that's a little bit because I have a very small lid, but also because it's very simple, very muted. Um, and let's move to the other eye to my second look. Look two uses four shades and is a little more dramatic. We start with undressed again, covering the whole eye, setting that primer. Next, take Unleash on the whole lid and a little bit higher up onto the brow bone. I do this because of my eye shape really enhances that color. Gonna take unedited on the outer half of my crease, really blend it in. Now I do the blending. I'm gonna take Unleashed again and really pack it back onto the lid. I really want this to be the highlight color, the highlighted color of this look. Lastly, we take Uninhibited and the brow and the inner corner to really highlight the look. 
give us some brightness back in there. Blend to get rid of any harsh lines and the look is complete. So there's look two, it's a much more nighttime look as opposed to the daytime look. You can go big and extreme with the gold or you can go to sort of muted. This palette does it all. Next we're gonna do a look with the brown side of the palette. It's not quite me, but it'll be a good dramatic nighttime using browns. Look three uses four shades, all of them matte except for the last. We start with unwind at the inner half of my lid. Then take unedited into the outer half of the lid. I'm going to use Unafraid in the crease using my shadow brush as the crease brush. I try to blend these in together. quite working so we're gonna go back in again. We're gonna redefine those colors unwind and unedited. I'm gonna blend along this top line here, try to get rid of that harsh line. I'm going to add more unedited on the outer edge of the eye, up all the way up to the socket. Blend out the edges. I'm going to bring unwind up to the eye socket as well. Blend in again. Lastly, I'm going to bring Unlocked to highlight the brow and the inner corner of the eye. I think that this shimmering highlight really emphasizes the darkness of this look. Blend, and finally, the look is complete. So now that I've done a big dramatic brown eye, I want to do an everyday look gold eye. So I'm going to start with the color Unpredictable on my lid. I'm going to take Unlimited into my crease with my tapered crease brush. I'm going to put the Unlimited a little bit more on the outer half. I want to sort of emphasize that outer half of my eye with that darker color. Then I'm going to take Undressed along my brow bone and on the inner corner. And 
we blend to get rid of any harsh lines and the look is complete. So there we go. We've got a big nighttime brown eye look and a little uh, demure daytime gold look. And I will be right back with my last look. Look five uses four colors and is my sort of everyday look. We're gonna start with Unleashed in the lid all the way up to the crease. I really want this color to be big and bright and beautiful, so we're gonna emphasize it up a little bit. Take unedited on my fluffy crease brush into the entire crease, though we do focus a little bit more on the outer corner. I'm gonna add some more Unleash to the outer corner to make sure it does cover that whole lid after we add it in the crease color. I'm gonna take Unpredictable and pack it into the inner half of the lid. I'm gonna take Unlocked along my brow bone in the outer corner of my eye. Lastly, blend those in together, see what happens. Take a little bit more of unedited into the outer corner and with a dotting motion, add a little bit more. I want that outer corner to be a little darker and blend it in. Take a makeup wipe to clean out the fallout, finish your blending and you're good to go. enjoyed all those looks um this one is clearly my favorite um let me know down in the comments below which one is your favorite of the five looks or what palette you think you could make 25 looks out of because it has to be a sort of specific palette it has to have a good range of those colors um i hope you guys enjoyed this i hope you like this video i hope you subscribe so that you don't miss the other four videos that i make looks with this palette so that I end up making 25 looks with the same palette. Oh my goodness, it's gonna be so much fun and so hard. Um, I hope you liked it, and I will see you all Monday.